Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the count if function to save time and improve your workflow. There's a link in the description if you'd like to download this document and follow along. You can also open this document and use it within Google Sheets. Let's look at a few examples of how we can use this in real scenarios. Let's say we want to count the number of people who are present in a meeting. In an empty cell, we can start with the equal sign, count if, open parentheses. Now we're going to select the range of the data, comma, and in two double quotes, I'm going to type in looking for the word present and hit enter. And you can see it has easily counted for us. We could also replace that with absent. Another example might be to calculate sales revenue and see how many of these sales transactions were above $500. Again, we're going to type equals count if open parentheses, select the range by clicking and dragging comma, and we're going to do the double quotes again. And now we're going to type in greater than symbol 500 enter. And now we can see that six of the values were above 500. You can also do equal to greater than or equal to. And now it's included this 500. One more example, I'm going to change a few names here. And let's look for how many names start with an A. So for this, we're going to do equals again. Count if, open parentheses, select your range, comma, open double quote, A, and we're going to do an asterisk, which is our wild card symbol, and close parentheses after that double quote. So these are a few examples to show how you can use it with text criteria, numbers and operators, and wildcards for partial matches. To save time, improve your accuracy, and boost productivity. If this video helped, please like the video so others can find it, and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching, and see you next time. Take care.